Entertainment Luxury. Dr. Dre is the stage name of Andre Ramelian, an American rapper, record producer, and actor. Dr. Dre is the creator of Beat Electronic and Aftermath Entertainment. He is the co-owner of Death Row Records and a musician there. Many well-known rappers, including Eminem, Zibit, 50 Cent, Nocturnal, Kendrick Lamar, and The Game, have benefited from his guidance. West Coast G-Funk is reported to have gained popularity in large part thanks to Dr. Dre. Dr. Dre's net worth is thought to be around $950 million. He is among the top for richest rappers in the world, behind Kanye West, Jay's, and P. Diddy in terms of assets and money. Today we'll be taking a look at the top 8 buys of Dr. Dre. Number 1 Aftermath Records In 1998 Dre launches his own label, Aftermath, and joins forces with Jimmy Iovine's brand new Interscope Records. Don Robinson of En Vogue left the group because she thought Aftermath was taking too long to promote her solo album, and the hip-hop ensemble The Firm disbanded soon after releasing its debut. But Dre heard a cassette called The Slim Shady Up one night in Iovine's basement, and Aftermath signed a new Detroit rapper named Eminem. Hip-hop icons like The Game, 50 Cent, G-Unit, and others came after. Due to a series of mergers in the music industry, Universal Music eventually acquired Interscope and became the largest record label in the world. Some will say it's the house that Dre built. Now I see how we got to the next episode. Number 2 Cool Car Collection Rolls Royce Drop Head Coupe Unquestionably, one of the most expensive vehicles available is a Rolls Royce. Sometime in 2012, a vlogger observed the multi-millionaire route and about in one of the favorite hangouts of Hollywood's A-listers. This luxurious car has a sticker price of around $450,000, but to Dr. Dre, that amount is like pennies. Dr. Dre did not appear to be particularly pleased about being filmed at that time, as can be seen in the YouTube video that Carson Stars released. 50 Cent is another rapper who owns the same vehicle in his collection. Ferrari Testarossa, one of the first supercars Dr. Dre had after the formation of his rap group Pen WA was the 1987 Ferrari Testarossa. He had to endure a police car chase in 1994 with his Ferrari, which the police recorded traveling at 90 miles per hour. It was real, but it's interesting to see that Dr. Dre still claims ownership of it now. With Ferrari's groundbreaking presence, they first fitted two side view mirrors on the outside, which has an all white texture. Hey Dre, let me ride. Co. Number 3 High School Students from the Eovini and Young Center Integrated Design, Technology and Entrepreneurship Magnet, a high school located at Audubon Middle School in the Limert Park neighborhood and founded by Andre Dr. Dre Young and fellow music industry tycoon Jimmy Eovini. First year and sophomore students have been drawn to the school in part because to the star power of its namesakes. Dr. Dre and Yovini mentions why they created the school, we found that in hiring people, they either had one of three or four different disciplines, Yovini said, either as engineers, designers, creative talent or business people. They didn't know how to work together. They didn't know how to speak together. And it's very, very important that in today's workplace that people do understand the other disciplines and are familiar with the other disciplines. Number 4 Lavish California Mansion To continue making music, he constructed an underground studio in his Brentwood, Los Angeles, house. Under his current home is a studio that is the size of a house. According to Amo Mama, he paid $40 million for his 18,298-square-foot house in 2014 from its previous owners, NFL star Tom Brady and his ex-wife, supermodel Giesel Bunt Chen. Brady and his wife had spent $11.75 million on the site and the initial portion of the mansion before expanding it and spending $20 million on construction before Dr. Dre bought it. After a year of not selling the mansion, which they had listed for $50 million, Dr. Dre agreed to buy it from them for a $10 million discount. Nothing but a G thing. Number 5 Halftime Show The 2022 Super Bowl Halftime Show Dr. Dre hit the stage alongside performers Mary J. Blige and Kendrick Lamar, as well as old buddies Snoop Dogg, 50 Cent, and of course, Eminem, who made a forceful statement by taking the knee to close out the night. 
Dre fronted the majority of the money required to pull off his performance. The National Football League allegedly tried to censor the performance by asking Eminem, actual name Marshall Mathers, to Fargo the divisive gesture that Colin Kaepernick, a former American football player, first used in 2016, according to a source close to the rapper, who was quoted in the Daily Mail. He paid $7 million of the $13 million budget to prevent attempts to edit the performances. The show carried on, as we all know. Number 6 Beats by Dre A brand of audio that has been culturally relevant in the majority of important sectors of popular culture, from sports to music, art to fashion. But Beats has succeeded in doing just that. Dr. Dre, a producer and rapper, and Jimmy Ovini, a co-founder of Interscope Records, founded Beats, which for the past 10 years has had a position in the public's mind that only a select few audio companies have attained. With the launching of the Mormat Collection, created in partnership with Farrell Williams, the company welcomed another expert to its team in October. The drop embodied the Beats formula cutting-edge technology, delivered and modeled by an enduring cultural figure. The volume on those Beats headphones can get explosive -y. Number 7 Roller Skates Since the 1970s, skating culture has experienced varying levels of popularity as well as a recent rebirth thanks to social media. Even the successful entrepreneur and rapper Dr. Dre enjoys a good pair of skates. Unfortunately, a fast-moving theft also has his beloved skates as its target. At least, that is the focus of a brand new shirt movie created for a special piece honoring the anniversary of his legendary studio album The Chronic. A limited edition and pair of roller skates that Dr. Dre and Jimmy Ovini released in conjunction with the renowned roller rink Flippers Roller Boogie Palace. Number 8 Divorce Settlement Nicole Young and Dr. Dre came to a divorce agreement. According to a source, Dre agreed to give his ex-wife $100 million, split into $50 million one year, and $50 million in the next year. Dr. Dre will retain ownership of his assets, music rights, and stock options. Nicole will be given a Range Rover, a motorcycle, and a Cadillac limo Escalade. Her fashionable apparel, jewelry, purses, and fur, which are thought to be worth millions of dollars, are also hers to keep. Been through a lot. And after all that it's still the diary. This is the end of Top 8 Luxury Buys Dr. Dre. Make sure to tap the like button and subscribe to see our next list. Bye for now.